Give me five. Give me five. Give me five. Ah. Today, friends, we are not talking about give me five. We're talking about a new strategy I designed called give me two. I'm the super brave teacher, Joel Karlewski, the super brave gay teacher. YouTube, you are listening. I am gay. We are going to tip YouTube in a radically positive and accepting way for all LGBTQI teachers and students. Woo! Anyway, back to Gimme 2. I really got this idea because I have been noticing that all teachers have a strategy for getting attention. One that is common is to say, Gimme 5. And some people have five different things a child should be doing at that time, or it's just that simple idea of give me five. And then students are supposed to raise their hand and then other students notice that other kids are raising their hand and then all eyes are on the speaker. Fine strategy, I am, if it works for you, go for it. If you like to clap, if you like to sing, if you like to ring a little bell, whatever <laughs> works for you, I think that's great. But, I am here to talk about a strategy that I designed for myself, and it's called Gimme Two. I don't know if you're like me, but I've realized that especially in this technology age where we're always just on our phones, it's right in front of me, just, just in case I get a notification. Especially with a lot of technology and things going on in life, my brain is extra anxious. I'm not blaming technology, but I just notice, you know. I noticed that with so much going on in life, my body is extra anxious and I'm just holding so much in. There's so much noise around me that I don't even know sometimes what I'm thinking or feeling or what I want. So I designed a strategy for myself called Give Me Two. And I also have an affirmation with it, which is I will use Give Me Two any second of any day because I'm worthy of rest. I am worthy of listening to myself. So let me give you a situation. I might be in a meeting and people are talking, 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 and my brain starts spinning. I just say, friends, give me two. And in that moment, I give myself two minutes to be quiet. That might mean I go on a little walk around the hall. That might mean that I just sit and close my eyes. That might mean that I go outside and take a deep breath. Whatever that means for me, that's what I do for me. I might be with my students and everything's just going, going, going. Senor Kolowski, Senor Kolowski, this person, da, 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 da. I need help with my backpack. I can't tell my shoes. It happens all the time. And I might just say, you know what friends? Senor Kolowski is gonna take two minutes. And I might just sit down on our take a break chair or on our hug chair, we have a hug chair. And I might just breathe. And I'm just sitting there breathing. And the whole point of this is quieting my brain enough to bring, to come back to being present with myself, to notice what I'm feeling, and to realize that I already have what I need right here. Because once my brain starts going, I'm like, I need this and I need to do this and I need this. And the moment I start silencing myself and just calming myself down again, I realize I have enough, and I am enough. I have enough, and I am enough. So when I say take two, be really thinking about those two things. I am enough, I have enough. Can you tell I teach kindergarten? <laughs> take two, take, touch your nose. Uh, <laughs> two things, I am enough, I have enough. Right here. What a great strategy. Woo! So take two today with yourself. Take two, take two, take two. I am enough, I have enough, I am enough, I have enough. Go kindergarten today. If you need to be like, I need to take two, do it. If that helps you remember it, do it. What are your strategies? Leave it in the comment below so I can steal it and make it my strategy for myself too because every day I'm learning, I'm the super brave teacher who is here to teach you but also knows that you, being you, are a teacher, a super brave teacher for me and I wanna know what you think. Like this video, share this video, leave a comment below. Let Google and YouTube know that we are worthy 
by continuing to watch these videos again and again and again and again and watching other LGBTQ teachers out there who are doing their thing. Support us all. You are awesome. Take care of you. Take two for you. Bye, friends.